<laughs> I'm just gonna be laughing through this whole section. This is wonderful. Hello, I'm Sexy Jesus, and welcome back to Spyro 3. In my last video, I went to Dino Mines where I looked like a complete scrub. That level was pretty hard. And I went to Harbor Speedway where. I raised some boobies, that was uh, that was interesting, and I played as Hunter and he chased after a UFO like he always does. This video, it's going to be the final video. I think anyway, because we're going to take on the Sorceress, we're going to complete Sparks' last level, we're going to get all the gems, we're going to go to the secret uh, level, it's going to be exciting and we're going to hop right into it. And also, uh, Merry Christmas, or whatever you celebrate, but whatever makes you happy, that's what I'm... Wishing you a happy of Mary of I don't know. <laughs> Time to kick some sorceress butt. Uh, all right, just get get straight to it. it I, I figured there would have been an uh, cutscene in this, and um, I don't think the sorceress is that hard. I don't think she is too hard. But I already see what we have to do. I'm assuming we're gonna have to get. Can I just flame her? No. No, I cannot. I can't charge her flame. I got hit twice already. Oh wow, you... <laughs> She's chased me with her flabs, okay. Um, oh, alright. Yeah, so Agent 9 will just shoot random weapons down to you. I'm, oh, I'm okay with that. I'm okay with that. God dang it. Do you please just... Yeah, take the hit. Thank you. Okay, so uh, uh, all that's up there is uh, cannons and sheep, apparently, for some reason. Like, why does she have this battlefield, which is, which actually is like almost an exact replica of Ripto's uh, arena? What's this? Oh, yeah, we can control this cannon. All right. Now, this makes things a bit easier. Nope. God dang it. Try to get her with the cannon. Get her with the cannon. There we go, one hit. Nope. Oh, that one actually had a man. Thank you, sheep. Thank you, lucky sheep. Yes! Okay, she got me, but I got her. Alright. Oh, a UFO. Go! Yes! No? Oh, wow, this is... This is really easy to get her now. I can just fly away when she's about to attack me. Woo! I'm pretty sure this fight has multiple sections, though, so it's not going to be this easy. Ow! No! Oh my lord. I need that sheep. I need this sheep. I really need this sheep. Okay, thank you. Yes! And in the lava she goes, just like Ripto. She's attempting to try to copy the best villain in the series. S uh, sorry, sor sorceress, but you're not going to get that lucky George. I thought we got a George. I feel like these names are repeated, but it's not telling me that I already got it, if that makes any sense. Alright, that's... that's it? Okay, we fly away to the heavens, because I guess that's the most logical way to end the game. Uh, actually, no. No. Deja vu? <laughs> it's mimicking the uh, end of the first game. Spyro, you've just defeated the sorceress, rescued the dragon eggs, and restored freedom to the lost dragon Is it Bob? What do you plan to do next? Hmm? Perhaps a nice vacation in Dragon Shores? Hmm? <laughs> You're a real comedian sometimes, Bentley. Bent. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> I have brain control with you, god damn it. <laughs> uh, you know, I still have to find the rest of the dragon eggs. Plus, Hunter seems to have disappeared again, so I should go make sure he's not in more trouble. You haven't seen him, have you? Huh? Me? Oh, no, no. If I do happen to encounter him, however, I will most certainly inform you immediately. I... A familiar it's a funny face. thing, Spyro. There's I Laura. After I finished finish everything. Dragon worlds, but somehow I ended up here. She doesn't want me Being unless I do cool things. Out of date by a thousand years. That would explain why the book was so cheap. So, now that you're done saving the world again, 
Are you gonna visit me in Avalar? Sure, Alora, but I still have to find the rest of the eggs and, well, Hunter's disappeared again. Did you say, Hunter? Well, hey, I can help. I just saw him sneak off with... Uh, uh, -huh. uh Agent Nine, isn't that a Rhinoc over in those bushes? A uh, Rhinoc? Ooh, let me at him. You want a piece of me, Rhinoc boy? Eat laser punk? Come on now, no fair hiding. Uh, I'm sure Hunter is in good hands. But I mean, I'm sure he will turn up soon. Promise you'll come visit Avalar soon, okay? Of course, of course. Even though I can't in this game. Now how many times have I told you not to tease that moose? It was Billy's idea! Uh, yeah, yeah! <laughs> Is that true, Billy? <laughs> Hold that thought, Billy. Spyro, great to see ya! Hi, Sheila. I've been looking for Hunter all day. Have you seen him? <laughs> Sorry, Spyro. Hunter made me promise not to tell you where they went. Say, hey. <laughs> you didn't hear anything from me. Oh, no. Oh, no, 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 no. One less noble warrior. Mwah. It's a sad sight, Sparks. Another noble warrior falls victim to the plague of love. Just look away. Well, I guess we'll have to find the rest of the eggs by ourselves. Come on, Spyro. Take a little break. Let's watch the show. So the plot, the plot twist was he did friend zone. Spyro, Spyro friend zoned her. How does that even happen? Alright, so there we go, we beat the game, I'm gonna go ahead and skip through the end, and then we're gonna go to Sparks' level and get the, uh, gems. Alright, let's do this. Just before you kick the sorceress's big, fat, ugly butt, she built a factory to make robotic bugs to fight Sparks. But I don't think they're any match for him. Enter Bug Bot Factory Bonus World? Well, let me tell you, I'd rather probably shave my junk with a rusty butter knife opposed to, to playing another Sparks level, but you know what? Screw it! Let's do it. Let's do it. Alright, here we go. We're in another uh, Sparks top-down shooter world where it's going to be extremely annoying and we're fighting robots and <laughs> I'm sure that this one's going to be really, really hard and then it's going to make me rage and I'm going to be here forever. Are you kidding me? Is this like a thief bug? Get out of here! Good lord! They're, they're just trying to make this uh, these levels even more annoying. No! Okay, so... So if all the bugs, you, you make robots out of ladybugs. Okay, because ladybugs are intimidating. God dang it! Okay, there we go. And th there's another bug team. God dang it. Go, just go. Let's... I'm trying to just quickly go through this level. I, I do not enjoy these levels at all. I thought, oh, okay. These levels are, probably aren't as bad as I remember. And I played the first one. Well, okay. It wasn't that great, but you know what? I I'll live with it. Now that I've played through uh, uh, this one being the fourth, well, I realize that they are <laughs> some of the worst levels in this game. I, <laughs> they're not enjoyable. I mean, they're, they're, they're not terrible, I suppose. But still, it just it takes forever. It really does. It just takes forever. And we have invincibility, so I should hurry up and use this while I have the chance. I'm wasting my time. I should be shooting these guys. Okay. We'll go up here. And which, uh, it was a... I had to unlock the door that led to a bug that has a key to unlock another door. Okay. Not only are we making the levels harder and more annoying, we'll also make them tedious as well. We'll just we'll just completely go out of our way just to annoy Jesus. And not the Jesus, me Jesus, the, the guy you're watching. And I'm almost dead. I should be careful and I should be focusing on what I'm doing, but you know what? I'm sort of raging at the moment. I have to get out my bent up frustration about these levels. Can I go through here? No, I can't. I would much rather be playing Loaded right now. I really would. That sounds actually very enjoyable right now, but no, no, I'm playing, playing Sparks' top. Oh, great. Yeah, sure, bombard me with enemies, because I enjoy that. 
Now, fortunately, I can't just leave these guys because I need the gym that they drop. There we go. Power up. Thank you. Beat it. All right. See, that's how we do it. Get out of here. Really? Okay. Got those gems. Uh, I'm pretty sure we only have a couple more doors. Oh, yeah. We should only have just one more door to go into now. This one, right? Is this, is this open? It, it is. Okay. I was about to say, like, no, it's not open. I'm going to be trapped here forever. Oh, no. Well, I guess that was sort of my fault. I was a bit close, but uh, still, still. We'll just grab the gem. We'll just grab the gem, which leads to a dead end, which uh, isn't good when you have enemies following you. And he's going on. I'm going to leave him be. I'm just going to leave him be. He ain't bugging anybody. He's just going to go have some fun somewhere. God! Dang it! So, I mean, I, I guess I can't really complain about the difficulty, because uh, I, I don't lose lives out here while being here, and they start me exactly at the last door I went into, so it's not that bad of a penalty for dying, but still, it's just like this. This is annoying. This is annoying. Like, I'm, I have to just slowly try to get a couple hits in on him, or try not to get hit myself. I should have a power-up for this, but you know what? Uh, I, I sucked, and I lost it. Actually, I didn't lose it. I used it all up on uh, minor enemies. Alright, screw it. Just gonna save me. Oh, okay, that didn't work. Okay, so... We'll, we'll just take our time later. We won't try to rush. We'll just take our time. That's a more logical strategy, right? You know, it, it just takes forever, and this, like, these levels... I don't, I don't like them. There's probably people like, oh, I like them. Okay, I like them. I don't. I really don't. There we go. Okay, let's let's get moving. Oh, of course, they have generator bugs, robots, whatever. Go, 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 go. Get, get, get up from behind me. Okay, get this, get this stupid thief. Come here. There we go. Thank you for that. Thank you for giving me the key. Just. He just gave it to me. He just gave it to me because he loved me. Alright, I had to take it by force, but you know what? God! Dang it. Okay, these guys are bums now to get the key again. And this should be the boss fight up here because I got all the gems. Oh, the centipede, alright. Ow. There's bugs watching us battle, so are they going to get involved? I feel like they're probably going to get involved. Okay, uh, I'm dead. Alright, alright. So this dude isn't really that bad, you just have to avoid his head. Really all you have to do is just circle around him. Oh, he splits in two, I forgot about that. Oh yeah. Okay, so this this is about to get a lot more difficult and a lot more annoying and a lot more rage inducing and I'm getting hit. We need to stop doing that. That's not healthy for me. Okay, his bits are falling off. God dang it, get away from his head, I got hit again. Oh, by the way, his body doesn't hurt you, so just as a heads up, you can sort of use that as a strategy. Okay, so that's one head, and I'm still mostly healthy, so I think I've got this. Just have to be careful. Not do stupid stuff like that, just like that. I should not be doing that. Oh, come on. Oh, yeah. You're done, son. You're done. You're done. You're done. I'm the victor. Give me my god dang egg. Annabelle. I know for sure we got an Annabelle. Am I going crazy? They're repeating names. Alright, let's get out of here. That last egg must have had some extra magic because it gave Sparks two new abilities. Now he can break open treasure chests and using the Atlas, he can warp you to any level. Just select the level you want and press the square button. Oh, well, th that's convenient. Oh, <laughs> I know what this part is. This part is awesome. Don't worry, Spyro. I won't be needing any more of your money. Now, now, don't look so surprised. I found one of the dragon eggs, and I'm going to sell it for a fortune back in Avalar. Uh, uh-oh. Uh, why are you looking at me like that? <laughs> I, uh, uh, I, I've got to be going now. Uh, toodles. Come back here, you got dead cheap state. Yes. <laughs> oh, I'm just gonna be laughing through this whole section. This is wonderful. Give me all my god dang gems back, you fat piece of trash. I almost fell off. Uh, 
But you know what? I would have been happy with that just because I can get all these hits in on him and get all my money back. He's been taking from me for all this time. All this time. I'm getting my money back and I get the flames there. Drat. Double drat. Drat, 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 drat. Oh, I never knew dragons were so fast. That's it. I give up. I'm retiring to Spooky Swamp to become a haiku poet. <laughs> Give me my egg. Al. We got Al. <laughs> what a wonderful name. He was the same and he just ran into Crystal Islands. That, that was a spooky swamp. He's an idiot. And the counter's still going up too. Is it 15,000? Yep, 15,000 gems. Um, what do we need to get in here? Oh, we can go in it. <laughs> Super bonus round. Away! Okay, so I'm pretty sure I know what this is, but uh, I'll, I'll, I'll let you guys see it as we appear. Oh, wait. Oh! Okay, okay. So, so actually, there there's actually more. Yeah, okay. Hey, you finally made it, Spyro. Hunter was a little worried about you when you went off to fight the sorceress, but I always knew you'd beat her. This place is where the sorceress kept all her treasure. But after she was defeated, a bunch of thieves came and stole it. If you can catch the thieves, you're more than welcome to keep the treasure. Well, I was planning on taking it regardless, so, you know, I feel like I deserve it. Uh, even though I sort of just got a bunch of money from money bags, and... Oh! They just decided, yeah, well, you know what? Here's just a giant amount of gems for no reason at all. Even though they do that in, like, every game, but... Actually, except for the second one. The second one, they didn't really, like, just toss gems at you for no reason, but, uh... Yeah, this one, they're just giving me mass... mass amounts. But yeah, there is a section here. It's probably the very end of all this. I, I... I'll keep that a secret until we actually get there. God... Dang it! Stupid thief! Of course, we just had to have... One more scene of me falling into some random lava pit. There. <laughs> I, I just like how all the gems just come flying to me and you just hear that... You hear all the chinging from the gems all at once. It just sounds amazing. It's just so beautiful. <laughs> Alright, so I'm... I'm, I'm just I'm about to fall to my death. Just gonna go ahead and grab all these random gems sitting around. I'll get the, there are a lot of thieves around here. Like, they were all up on it, like, oh, the, the sorcerer de is dead? Alright, <laughs> let's go. They just formed a meeting and everything. Just, uh, these guys are annoying. Good lord. Because it's like we have to constantly keep jumping, and I mean, sometimes I have to be careful not to fall off, and, and so I go a little bit slower, and thus that makes them get further away from me, and uh, it just... It, Increases the chasing more than it needs to be, but oh, too too easily. Um, I actually need eighteen thousand five hundred gems to get in that door, so <laughs> I feel like I'm gonna be able to get that pretty quickly. Right after I clear all these, we will head up over here, which leads to just that one gem. But I've been running past all these doors, and I haven't really been going up to them. Seventeen thousand. All right. What about this door? Surely I can get in this one. Yes, I can. All right. Where is this taking me? What is this? Hi, Spyro. Did you see Bianca? She was really worried about you when you went off to fight the sorceress. It was pretty funny. She tries to play it cool, but she was scared stiff until you came back safe. Hunter is annoying. Hunter is very annoying. I just annoying. finished fixing up an old submarine. Why don't you try taking it for a spin? And let me guess, by fix it up, you mean you just got the submarine from the sunken uh, ship? I forget the name of the level, but yeah, Great. you know what I mean. Hop aboard! Alright, let's, let's go do this. What are we even doing? Oh, we're taking on more subs. Oh, yeah, because that's what I wanted to do. Are we just going to, like, repeat uh, games I've already played? I feel like that that's what we're actually going to end up doing. I just play remix versions of games I've already played, and they just reward me with massive amounts of gems. 
to a degree, I'm okay with that, as long as it's not some stupid game I hate. Submarine game, I'm sort of 50-50 on, because it's like it's not really that hard, it's just it can take some time. And there we go, alright. It's not gonna work me out, I just have to leave myself. Alright, so let's, uh, let's see what's behind, uh, door number two, which, uh... Probably isn't gonna be. Oh no! Check it out. No. This is the world's fastest turbo no. snowboard course. The local champions are the Sasquatch Six, a gang of Yetis on souped-up snow discs. I bet that you could outrace the lot of them. If you win, we get a huge pile of treasure. If you lose, I have to slick down the whole course with my tongue. I should lose on purpose. So ready to race? Oh gosh, Hunter, I'm ready and willing. <laughs> Gone. Just don't lose, or my tongue's gonna be a popsicle. Alright. Let's And there's gems on the course I have to get oh my god. Let me guess I have to hit the crabs to get turbo I do! Great! Great. And I'm oh I remember this one just being very very annoying. In fact, I think I remember this course the most of the two. Actually, we only raced like one other time, but of the two uh, racing uh, courses, I remember this one. Don't know why, but I do. Probably because I, it was hard and annoying, and I hate it. Uh, that's what I'm. Pro I'm gonna go with. I hate it. <laughs> I just hate everything at this point. Yes! Completely wrecked him. Okay. God dang it. You know what? I completely forgot I should be doing tricks to get turbo. Come on. There. Oh my god. Yes! You schooled them like a bunch of frost-bitten, flat-footed, molasses-eating, lead-pants-wearing, cross-eyed glacier trolls riding slabs of plywood with sandpaper on the bottom! And we won some shiny stuff, too. We won some shiny stuff, too. Okay, for that race, you have to have turbo basically the entire time. The first ramp you use, make sure you do, like, five flips on it so you can boost your turbo all the way up. I'll probably have a clip on how I did it and pop up right now. And that's how you do it, and uh, you just make sure you, you repeat that every time on every lap and you try and don't fall off. <laughs> don't fall off and use the uh, missiles to your advantage. And look at all these gems. Oh my god. That many shouldn't have fit in that chest. <laughs> it's physically impossible. Alright, I'm go also gonna run the course real quick and pick up any gems I missed. I didn't show them because, well, y you can figure them out. It's a, a straight track. One? <laughs> if I only left one, I'm gonna say that, that that's pretty good. Uh, no, no, there, there was a two-point gem. And I think that was it, so, uh, yeah, I'll say that's it. Let's go, let's get some good... Let's do something else. So now we can head. Oh, this actually just opens pathway. Oh, I can go fly now. And I'm guessing I have to go take down the UFOs. Take down the UFOs, Hunter. At... Apparently, I can't, I can't ever take down completely because they keep coming back. So even when we're at the end of the game, I actually have to do his. Still have to do all his work for him. God dang it. One. I don't even know how I got him, but uh, I'll accept it. Oh wow, wow. I'm just wrecking them. <laughs> Power lasts forever, I love it. Give me this, thank you. Oh, there's the last one right here. Oh no, there's two, actually. <laughs> My mistake. Oh well, more treasure for me. Come here. Come here. Just keep spamming them with them. Yeah, avoid that. He's a trash. Pretty sure that I need to go right here. 20,000 gems. 5,000 out of 5,000. Well, okay, let's get up out of here. I'm assuming that's the last pit. Yeah, this is the part I was thinking about. We have to take on the sorceress again. I don't again. know how she did it, Spyro, but the sorceress must have survived that last battle. She's been waiting here all this time, saving up her magic to destroy you. But well, that sounds awfully nice of her. <laughs> Your best chance to defeat her is to borrow my flying saucer. 
I've cast some spells on it to give it extra firepower and unlimited flying time. But Ooh. the rest is going to be up to you. You've come this far, Spyro. I know you can beat her. All right, all right. Let's let's get the uh, let's get it on. Let's get it on. I'm pretty sure that this part is not that hard. Like I'm pretty sure that like this is, is even easier than her first form. Just have to avoid her attack and just keep bombarding her, basically. She makes those god awful screams. Like just stop. You're disgusting. Okay, so make sure when she fires to get, just go left or right because uh, if you try to go up, she tends to hit you. Okay, they're, they're, she's starting to move a bit faster now, so it's harder for me to keep up with her, and, th and thus it makes it a lot harder for me to actually get a shot. Bam, yes. Bam. Unless God screw, I'll just take the hit. There! Back in the lava you go! Which how did she end up how did she end up here? I, I don't know. I don't know. She came here and then got a UFO. Yin Yang. We got Yin Yang. Which is uh It's twins, two twins, Yin and Yang. The end. Hi, Dad. <laughs> well, that was the best secret ending I have ever seen in a game. <laughs> but yeah okay so the game's complete now um the only thing i did complete i don't think i got all the skill points which all that does is once you get them all it's like it opens up like a little thing in the journal you can see like just little descriptions of what happened to the characters after the game i think or is that the second game i forget but yeah that that was spyro 3 it's it's a good game it's a good game i still prefer the second one and the first one over this one Mostly, the second one I think is just the best game. First one just has its own vibe and it has that original feel. It has its own vibe, and this one it's, it just feels like a giant expansion to two, which isn't a bad thing. It's just that there's not a lot of new things happening for it, other than the new characters, obviously. And also, the villain wasn't that great compared to compared to Ripto, anyway. Probably better than Nasty Nor because we got a bit more dialogue with her, but still. So yeah, that, that will end the series. I, I probably play more Spyro games in the future at some point, maybe? There's a lot I've never played, and also there's there's one in particular I have played. Enter the Dragonfly, which I don't plan on ever playing that one, because that one is... That one's trash! So I don't know exactly what the next game will be. I'm thinking... I, there are uh, some SNES games I want to record, but also there's also a ton of PS1 games I want to play too, so I'll leave it up to you guys. If you want an SNES game, comment SNES. If you want PS1, comment PS1 and I'll play either one. If nobody comments, then I'll just decide myself because that's the only other solution. But uh, yeah, I'll go ahead and end it here. This was Fire 3. I wrecked the sorceress. It was great. It's all, all in the video here. Till the next video, I'll miss you. Yeah.